<laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's what it is. Es muy piquito español. Poquito español, pero es que porque casi una vez compré un instructivo. Así está. Oh, oh, okay.
25? Nice, nice. Okay. Is that bien? Mm. Let's see. Um, how much are your pens? What? Your pens. How much? These? Todos? Si. Sí. Todos, todos? Yes, todos? Yes. Con todos los discos, guarda todos, lo guarda todos los discos estos. Todos son de karaoke. What are you asking for the set, man? For the hundred? Yeah. I bet, yeah. <laughs> nice. Yeah, totals in there too. He's in that little baggie. Oh yeah. Oh, I see what's up. Okay. Wow. Nice, nice. Take four? Take five? <laughs> okay. So one dollar, right? How much is the bag? Dollar? Two dollars. Two dollars? All right, YouTube, this is my garage, man. This is the second garage. Much in, oh, there's my Ikea bag. God dang it. I was looking for the other one, man. Anyway, this is my other garage, man. Let me back up a little bit so you guys can see. Pretty cool. Anyway, so look, man. This is the Everlast bag that I got. Um, I checked comps. Uh, new ones are going for like 100. This is in really good condition. It needs to be wiped down. I'm actually going to just put this on Facebook Marketplace. Try to get at least 50, 60 bucks, man. It's all free money, though. All free money, man. Everlast back. Um, I did miss out on the bar. There was a bar there that this hooks onto. Someone had grabbed that. I didn't know it was for that, but you guys see the comps right here, what I'm talking about. Anyway, man, let's get back to the other garage and show you what else I got. Our YouTube, so it's actually the next day, man, because I was gonna film, but it was just too dark. So, anyway, man, let's go over the stuff I got. Um, starting off with the savers, I went there first. I did pick up the Seen It games, the by Twilight, brand new seal. Did pay up for it. Let me, um, I know I saw look, paid up for it, six bucks. Um, the problem with savers, man, actually, it was my fault. I forgot to donate something so I can get that 20% off. My fault on that one. But it was unexpected for me to go there. The next thing item I bought was this Biggie shirt. Paid up for this one again, man. $5.99. This will go into my collection of Biggie and vintage shirts, man. I know this is not vintage. Um, it's an original shirt. I don't even know what size it is. Um, the print is like a dark print, as you guys can see. But anyway, got the Biggie shirt. Um, on this Scenic game, I want to show comps. Maybe $25, $30, I think. I'm not sure. I gotta, I'll gotta. i post up the comps and sold comps if there's any. But I know I saw some good comps on it. That's the reason why I got it. Or I got it because it was Twilight. It's like, not my favorite movie, but I like watching it. Anyway, let's keep it going, man. Let's keep it going. All right. Um, then I went over to the swap meet. <clears throat> Picked up this plush animal right here. Um, I got this one just because it was just colorful. It was colorful and fluffy and rough and all that. And the name brand on it is, I don't even know. Yeah, that's it. That's the name brand on it. Wherever that said, my eyes are bad. I'll be real with you. Paid a dollar up for this. Um, didn't even see any sold comps. It was just a plush thing. It's all good. No rips, no tears. Um, so far, no stains. I do got to check it over thoroughly and clean it if I have to. Then the next item I picked up was this book. This is a um, 
I think it's two books. This is like two books. Basically, what to expect when you're expecting. I remember seeing these books like a long time ago. I think my wife had got one on one of our kids. But anyway, this book has some pretty good comps. No, no, actually, the comps are all over the place, man. They had one sold for 20 one sold for 10 and the other one sold for 15 or something like that. I'll post it up. But brand new sealed and only paid a dollar for it. So I wanted to get that one. Um, this next item I got, this Route 66 bag. Um, I'm kind of, you know, I don't know. It might be a bootleg. I'm not really sure. It looks pretty good. The only reason why I say that, I only found one on Macari posted up for like 25 bucks. Um, but that person had the exact bag look like, and a, but a, a tag on it, which I cannot find any tag on it. But other than that, the zipper works. Everything is good inside and out. No, look like no stains or nothing. Looks pretty good. Um, I'm going to see if I can get about 20, 25. Only pay two bucks for this though. Only pay two bucks. Then picked up this right here. This guy didn't know really. He didn't know what he really had, I think, on this one, man. He didn't know what this was. I'm looking at it, and I'm like, oh, wow. Sony, first of all. Um, check the comps on these, $25, $30 or so. I think it was. I ended up paying $5 for it. I did try to negotiate. I didn't try too hard because I asked him what he'd take for, but he was stuck on 5 So 5 bucks for that. See what happens. Now, I went to the bookstore, Amazon Ben's Return Store. Now, I haven't been there in a while. Um, just been busy and didn't held up, but I know these books was making me money. So I had to go back. But the crazy part is I went back on a $3 day. Yes. A $3 day reason why, because the last time I went there, someone went through the books before me. So someone like basically beat me to the game. So let me go on the $3 day, which is the day before the dollar day. Let me see what I can find. And yes, I did run into this one dude. He had a bunch of books in his hand. He actually tried to school me on how to sell books. They do have Scout IQ opened up, scanning his book, blah, blah, blah. But he's only been selling for five months, according to him, and he's paying $45 a month. For us. I told him, I said, bro, I got the Amazon app, and I pay $0 a month, and I'm doing the same thing you're doing. Anyway, that's just me, though, man. Um, if I was to be deep, heavy in these books, Maybe I'll get Scout IQ, you know what I'm saying? Maybe it'll advance me more. I don't know, but I'm not that deep in the game yet, so I'm not going to spend 45 or more. I don't know, but that's just my opinion. But anyway, man, picked up this first book, Transcending Trauma. Oh, and by the way, this already sold for $16.79. Unfortunately, I did pay up on it, man. $3 a book is what I paid. Um, but yeah, this sold. I'll post up the comp right there. Just sold it this morning, um, so that was pretty cool. This next book I got was Preschool Lesson Plans. And I'm going to post up on the side um, what each book, what's my potential profit on each of these books once they sell. This next one I got was Tarantula Galleria. Um, all these books have some pretty good ranks on it. Not the best, but pretty good. Should be selling soon, hopefully. Um, Blockchain Wars. Picked up this book. Actually, I got two of them. And hopefully my profits are still good because these books are like stock. The ranks goes up and down. Crazy. Got this CCS book, Exam Study Guide. You guys see the comp on that one. Then there was another book, which I thought it was the same book. Another CCA Exam Study Guide. It's a uh, medical coding pro. That's what they are. And I posted a comp on that one. So my total spent on these books was $20, $21 plus tax. Um, I already got back some money now. $16.79 that sold for, I believe it was. And um, that's it, man. That's all we got. All right, YouTube. So that's it. That's my haul. I paid up to make a buck. That's what it is, man. I'm going to post up my potential profit right here, what I should make. Hopefully, as soon as all this stuff sells, except for the Biggie shirt that's going in the collection. I got a pile of vintage and Biggie shirts. Just I'm just stacking up. Uh, waiting for that one buyer to come through and buy it all. But other than that, man, if you haven't already, man, make sure you subscribe. Check out the new game show, Are You Smarter Than a Reseller? I'm about to get ready to go live on that one in a bit. Other than that, I'm out. Peace.